talking about predictions. This is gonna be a good week. It's gonna be a new exciting thing for Force 2. I got to say, I just woke up. I'm sorry, fellas, I was asleep. But I got to come out here and let y'all know what is up and what is going on. We about to advance, and I got to get predictions out to you. So I'm gonna start my first predictions. I'm gonna start it with the Jets and the Bills. I said the Bills are going to win this one big. You want to know why they're going to win this big? Because the Tyrod Taylor and McCoy is going to definitely figure a way to get it done. Boop, boop, boop. It's going to be a victory. The Hattenburg Show will not continue. That's my boy Pete. We'll get the victory. The Bills will win this one big. HBO out. When I think about the Eagles and when I think about the Bears, I got to say that my boy Kane is coming out here playing hard, doing what he do, but he ain't seen my boy shot down from Philly. I definitely predict Philly to get it done. And when I talk about getting it done, I'm talking about beating him by a touchdown. This is going to be a good one for my boy shot down, and he going to definitely get it done. I got to say, victory by the Eagles. Oh, and when I think about the Packers and Vikings, I got to say that my boy Packers isn't done losing. He on the road to trouble. And I definitely think my boy Major Fact is going to come out there and give him a little poop, poop, poop. It's going to be smashing mouth football. This is going to be an easy one for him. He's really that good. And when he comes correct, expect Major Factor to get a shutout. 21-0, Vikings. And when I think about the Colts and when I think about the Broncos, I got to say if the Broncos don't play his game, I will boot him. He will get two feet kicked. Poop, poop. That's less than me, but he will get booted real quick. But I got to say, I, I expect the Colts to come out here. My commissioner, t Rock will come out here and show his offense, show what he has got. My boy Jigga hasn't played a game yet. How could he win this one? So I got to say that the Colts are going to win this one. 10-0. What a boring game. When I look back and I lean back and forth, I got to say the Raiders is a good team. And he definitely does what he do. He bring nice teams to the table. But when I think about my bird man, the Atlanta Falcons, I think about the Julio Joe Show. The Julio Joe Show coming back and I got to say that the Atlanta Falcons are going to come play. Who's going to win this one? It's going to be the Falcons. 28 to 21. Another close game, but my boy Birdman will come out and get a victory, and I predict him to get it done. Yes, sir. It's going to be a good one here between the cars and the Bucks. I got to say the cars got a blowout last week, and he'll come out here and do it again. The Buccaneers been investing in action, and he ain't ready for the cars. Because if you've seen this thing, you better be afraid to play the game, because the cars are definitely going to get it done, because HBO said so. Oh, the Ravens and Browns, you got to say that the Ravens is really that good. He's definitely going to come out here and get the Browns. I will get a new user because the dude couldn't handle it in four, so he quit. And he think I can replace him? I'm HP. But the Ravens are going to come out here and probably get a forced victory or end up beating this new, new dude 26-26-6. And like 26-6, I mean 26-6. So we'll see. Chiefs and Texans, I got to say that the Texans is from the Mad Gridiron League. And he's definitely going to come out there and play his best football. If you don't know J.J. Watt, he's going to get a few sacks. And the Texans is going to come out here and do what they do best. So, the Chiefs need to come out here and be ready for this opponent. This is a really serious game. And I predict, baby, that the Texans going to come out there and win 28-7 to because it's too much D out there, baby. Think about the Seahawks, uh, Seattle and Rams. I got to say HBO is crazy for the mad game. I'm going to come out there and give him what I do best. The boo, boo, boo. And if I win, I'm going to do it. We're going to drive it down his chest. It's going to be a hard game. I know the Seahawks got squad. And I know he's trading all over the league. But I predict the victory will be 
28 to 7, Seahawks. Whoa. Be a good team between two even teams. I got to say the um, Titans and the Lions is so so really uh competitive. But I got to say that the Titans should get it done because he's from the Mile League. That boy's pretty good. He knows how to play the football. He knows how to get Mariola involved. And once he gets his team pumped up, he's definitely gonna get a victory over these boys. What I think about my boy Portland, my boy Portland out there, out there in Vegas, man. My boy be hustling, doing what he do, man. Like straight up and Madden, he gets it done. I predict him to get his first victory over the Miami Dolphins because my boy Portland is really the truth when he comes out here and play. Last week was a disaster, but I think he'll make a comeback win here and get it done. I think about my boy BJ for the Saints. He can't get it done. Last week was very depressing. And I got to say that the New York Giants is really that hungry and ready to eat. So I predict him to come out with him with a big chunk victory. 26 to 2. I'm just kidding. It's more like 28 to 3 because my boy BJ is awful, bro. He's really that awful right now. Oh, and when I think about the San Francisco 49ers and the Panthers, the Niners is tanking, but that's my point here, Commissioner. So the Panthers go win this, and I ain't got a lot to say. Crook Klaus with the victory all day. What'd it do? You know what I'm saying? I'm about to walk into my crib right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to smash uh, the Jaguars. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? We got the Kush on deck. You did All day, every day. I smelled that shit before I even opened this. You know what I'm saying? About to smash something. Take this ass whooping and enjoy it. You feel me? I'm out here. Force. It's going down. Oh! You talk like that to a man that you ain't played before? You get the boo, boo, boo. You get stumped out. You get kicked. You get down on the ground, you you just follow. You just you just dead. But what I got to say, you don't talk mess into the game. It's over with. The final touches was done by my boy Jay House, and he will do it again to the Chargers. Yo, and I got to say, I got to say, fellas, if y'all looking for another lead and you wanna be competitive, my boy Jay House got the lead, king of the hill. If you wanna tell a story, let's just see how you feel if you get your ass whooped. That's king of the hill. They give me the boo boo boo. That quick, you didn't even see that. That was just like a quick punch. So I got to say, it's been a good world, a good commentary. Play your games, Force 2. We in this bad boy, Force 1. We also competitive, but we got to keep it competitive. Madden World, HBL.